Yeah. Uh, very insightful, actually, Mike. I thank ICAC for uh, putting up uh, these questions, this set of questions on the ICAC World Cafe, because World Cafe is one of the most sought after events. And this very relevant question answered upfront from across the globe will help us make a roadmap out of, uh, you know, finding sustainable solutions to this issue. Like e-commerce, yes, everyone knows it's here to stay, but how to implement, how do we position ourselves, and is only the brand entitled to do it, or any other segment of the textile industry can explore and exploit this uh, opportunity. Sustainability, a very subjective word. Sustainability, again, a very subjective word, would be, here, stand up and put a price to it. Would it really make any difference to the buyer if they pay something extra so that the supplier complies with all the terms of sustainability and traceability? Because ultimately, it's going to come down to the farmer. And now we should not get more into documentation rather than forget the whole process and the whole impact that it was entitled to, you uh, know, get uh, out of all the sustainable and organic cotton that we are doing. So that. That was addressed today, and I, I really appreciate that. Again, audit party. Can we have a common audit platform? So important because every company, every association, every country, every continent would like to have a, a, a certification of its own. Is it really possible? We are living in a global world now. E-commerce has no boundaries. So why should certification be such a big issue and such a big cost? Somebody has to pay for it. Or the people will start finding loopholes which we do not want to happen in, in the long run. And going ahead, yes, role of ICAC. This has been discussed in detail during our discussion, and I hope that uh, something very concrete comes out of it. Thank you, Mike. Thank you very much.